Cardi, back off. No, I am not going to do it. Back off. Back off. Weapons on the ground. Step away from the suspect, ma'am. No. I want you to shoot him. You are the best. I should have aimed for your head. I thank God Carly told me you were coming. I, I, I didn't want you to. Everybody, run! You're coming by all of the security! Let her go! Back off! Sonny, please, let her go. How could you warn Alcazar? Call the cops! I didn't, Sonny, I swear I didn't call the cops! Come on! Get in! Get in! Get in! Close the door! Drive! Don't shoot! Drive! What happened? It, it was a setup, Sonny. Just took some girls hostage. They, they just drove off. Okay, I'm getting you out of here. Nobody's leaving yet. You're both material witnesses. You set him up. You were waiting for him. We got a call that he was coming down after Lorenzo Alcazar intending to kill him. I told you to leave. Carly, shut I up. wanted to stop this. Why did you call the cops? Sonny was coming after me. I wanted him stopped. <sighs> turn, turn here. Not, don't jerk it. Hey, just give me a little more warning next time, please. The roads haven't been plowed yet, and there's not really any. Yeah, keep driving. Keep driving. Okay, fine. Look, where are we going? What are you going to do to me when we get there? You going to turn me loose? I was going back there. The, 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 the cops, what, what they want with you? I got to get out of here. Disappear. You kidnapped me at gunpoint and forced me to drive okay, in the middle of nowhere, and I'm supposed to I trust just, you? I gotta get out of town. Maybe you don't remember, but the first time we met, you accused me of wearing a wire okay, because wait a I minute. wanted a job. Yeah, you came up out of nowhere. You were lying. So what? Look, I just... I was trying to trick somebody. Doesn't again. matter. Don't move. Look, all I'm saying is you're a little intense and obviously violent, so I'd like to get this over with as soon as possible. I trust these people the bigger risk is trying to get away on foot. So now what? We just wait and pray the cops don't show up. Yeah, huh? that's right. No offense, but aren't aren't you the kingpin? Don't you normally have guys doing the shooting for you? I've seen that guy's picture on the news before. Lorenzo something, right? Big South American drug, but anyway, whatever, it doesn't matter. It's none of my business what you're into. Alcazar kidnapped my wife. Watched her, stalked her for months. So you gun him down? Seems a little extreme. He had to be that way. There's no other ways to make him back off? It's complicated. Yeah, I may feel. Wife likes to buy back. Is that why you said she betrayed you? My wife was shot. She suffered a head injury. She remembers everything, you know, her family, her friends, everything she's ever done. But the connection is gone. She said it's like living in a picture of somebody else's life. Will she recover? I don't think it matters. Alcazar has been after her for months. He even sat with her while she was unconscious. 
Somehow he got into her dreams. I don't care. You know, I don't care what happened or why she's so confused. She set me up. She set me up. She practically warned me she would. What happened? Carly doesn't. My wife doesn't feel love for me. And she proved it tonight when she betrayed me. Maybe you're looking into this all wrong. Carly did something to hurt you. But you're looking into it. You're, you're, you're assuming the worst. I know what happened. Maybe you're the one Carly really cares about, not this guy, Alcazar. She tried to explain that to you, but you couldn't hear because you already decided she betrayed you. Oh, so now you're making all kinds of assumptions, is that right? Hey, I, I heard her <laughs> telling you that she didn't call the police. I, I, who, I don't care about the police. She warned my enemy. So you're not big on logic or explanations, are you? I know what I saw. All right, stop me if I get something wrong, okay? Your wife gets shot in the head while she's in a coma. Yeah. She dreams about another guy. My enemy. Okay, like right. she gets a vote on who she dreams about while in a coma. Anyway, she wakes up, right. understandably confused. She tells you the truth, which seems to me like a really sincere effort to try to be honest here. Honesty about thinking and loving another man. In her dreams. It's not like she's dating the guy. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be too sure at this point. Okay. <laughs> All right, this explains a lot. You are obviously fanatically jealous and possessive, which explains why when your wife told you the truth about her completely innocent dreams, your solution was to get a gun and shoot Alcazar? Do you have any kids? Two. Okay. Hear me out. You got a wife, two kids, and you're gonna commit murder on a street corner in front of God knows how many witnesses. Never mind the immoral objections. They sent people to prison for life for that. Sometimes you get the lethal injection. You're defending her now. Well, what if Carly's defending you? Did she try and stop you from going after her? Of course her? she did, because she's tried to save his life before. And now, you know, she wants the, the, the bastard alive. Or maybe she wants you free. Did you ever think of that? If the only way to prevent a murder is to get the potential victim out of town, that is what you do. No Alcazar, no murder. Now you're just a guy with a gun in a really bad mood, correct? Well, that's not how it worked out. I could have showed up with a bulletproof vest. Cops ready to ambush me. I could have died. But who, right? So who cares about that? Nobody? Huh? Well, maybe Alcazar just called the cops. I don't care who called the cops! Doesn't matter who called the cops! What matters is, she called him. Oh, okay, I get it. <laughs> you want Carly to be wrong. You think if you stop loving her, you'll stop hurting too. <laughs> Trust me, it doesn't work that way. I told you I'm not gonna kill you. Why do you give a damn what happens to my wife? There was something I wanted so badly, I, w I was willing to do anything to get it. And that included hurting somebody that I really cared about. He says I betrayed him. And he's right. I did. And now I probably never get him back, and it's exactly what I deserve. Sorry about that, Are you listening to a word that I'm trying to say right now? I, I'm trying to tell you that I recognize betrayal when I see it. And your wife didn't betray you. Carly fought for you. She didn't care about herself or, or her own safety. All she wanted was to protect you. She proved that to you tonight. Don't make the same mistake that I made you. You've got something 
really special. A woman you love who loves you back. Don't just throw that away, okay? Sonny Corinthos and Sam McCall didn't just disappear, okay? They have to be somewhere. <sighs> all right, all right, fine, fine. Just call me as soon as you find something out. get away yeah i'd like to hear the answer to that and i also like to get a statement from you how sunny corinthos abducted you at gunpoint sam just escaped her kidnapper let's make sure she's not hurt before she presses charges i won't be pressing any charges corinthos took you hostage at gunpoint and forced you to flee the scene of the crime with him no you got it all wrong I got 